everybody! Hello, everybody. Did you like the cool intro? I'm back for my week off, but everybody who's listening, which is Jen, she already she was with me, so she knows. Yeah, now we're back. Yep, that's one of our twelve listeners. Yeah, we actually had a bunch of uh, yesterday. I looked at I look at the analytics sometimes, and it just said uh, twenty eight listens from like one town. Oh, um, nice. And I'm like. It's old, old, pat, old, old, uh, it's an old oil town where they, they don't get out much. And someone's yeah, like, listen yeah. to this podcast of these two idiots. And then they're like, well, they're dumber than us. These guys are, these guys are dumber than us. I think they're racist too. So I like them. So today we have a shit ton of stuff because Corey did a cool West Coast trip. And also, I have a story about my grandpa and road rage. And some pretty serious shit happening. What? <laughs> yeah. So there's that yeah. uh, that we'll do, talk about. And uh, also, I got a little bit of a. Uh, uh, I'll Is see it? people not like on on their Instagram stories, like models. We'll talk about their only fans, nice. but they won't. They'll put a Z or they'll spell it funny. So sometimes I wonder, does it get flagged? I think it does. Yeah. Yeah. So would it, this YouTube because I said only fans does that make things flagged? I don't think so. I think you can or, say it. Yeah, I think you. Can, yeah. But just like Instagram, but like you can't like it's Facebook you can't promote it. Shit. Like they don't want, they're all against like yeah n- nudity. So like I think if you like promote it, I think that's why like they have to like I think I don't think you can like directly link it. That's why like they do those like little like link trees where yeah. they have all their stuff because yep. it's like which we have a link tree on our Instagram. Yeah, and we got some goofy clips. You can come to our only check fans. it out. We got an OnlyFans. It's it's all it's only my feet, and I dress my feet up in costumes and do little shows. But there's always feet cosplay feet sex at the end. We need to do this. Yeah, that's a good. That's not a bad idea. People are into feet. People are into cosplay. Feet cosplay and cats. Uh, if you guys are watching the video, we got a little kitty. Uh, he's not too little anymore. Named him Diesel when he was he's little. A ba- he's a big fat. He's a big oh, he's steakums. Thirty-eight pounds and uh, thirty-eight we, pounds. That's we changed his name from Diesel. Up. To big Steakums. Big Steakums. I did one time give him treats that said uh, grillers. It's just funny to give a an obese cat a, tr- a snack that says uh, friskies or whatever the heck He's it like, is. grillers. You talking He's about like, them grillers again? Man, you better put some on the grill for my ass. <laughs> Dude, I love grills. I love grilling. Um, I just listened to Andrew Santino. Whiskey Ginger, he had an episode, he has Pete Holmes on it, so they go way back, they they were doing like open mic, sort of like coming up first four or five years in comedy, they both were, uh, <clears throat> they like have some history, so they, they, they do what we do, so just now we just, we just went one from the, it's like a, Santino said, it's like a tree when we start talking. And it's just like, hey, I'm over here on this branch. Come over here. And then you, you jump <laughs> over to this branch. It's like, no, I don't want back over here. I'm on this other branch. And That's then we funny. just we just go off. And I'll, as he's talking about yeah, it, I'm like, yeah, Corey and I do that. that. Corey and I do that every episode. Even though Fuck I hate him. Pete Holmes. Just get, yeah, he's yap around. He's, he's cool. He's funny. He's he, funny. he always en- ends up finding a way to be serious and have serious questions about, like, God or aliens. He, like, has to. Kind of like Rogan will always end up being like, and monkeys are crazy, yeah. right? Like, we're monkeys. We're, we're animals. Like, Rogan Dude, will always end up doing that. We could shit on Rogan every episode. Yeah, we could. But now we're getting kind of shit on Pete. So, Pete, <laughs> which is funny, he always takes it to some, to some deep uh, God thing. You ever heard of Pete Holmes? <laughs> That's it. Get him out of here. Get him out. Get him out. Well, um, we can do some of your West Coast trip or whatever. Sometimes I think about doing the Tuesdays of stories, how they go back and forth. I'm hogging the mic, you know, and then passing it over yeah. so you don't feel like. But also, like, when I think about it. I'm like they have, they have fans that want to hear their stories, and I'm like, does anyone really want to hear the story? And then I'm like, ah, yeah. and then I'm like, you know what? Who cares if no one's listening? Yeah, dude. Just tell me what you'd want to tell me in real life. I'm gay. Th- they're not. <laughs> they're, they're not there. They're not paying attention. You know? uh, We're just alone in a room. <laughs> oh. Yeah. So we oh. went to. We okay, went to. Uh, went to Oregon. Or so yeah. This is another thing. A dilemma we've been having. Yeah. Is it? Oregon or Oregon? Oregon. 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 I've always said Oregon. Do they say it different there? Oregon. Well, Jen, Jen we couldn't remember because we joked Oregon. about every time we went to a place going, how do you say where we are? But uh, <laughs> I'm in Oregon. Oregon. The, Jen said the guy, in the, our shuttle bus driver. That's from Michigan the, against Oregon. 
I don't know. I, pick, I think about it in college football terms. Yeah. It's called like, MSU. Because it's spelled Oregon. Or, Oregon. Yeah. Oregon. But then, like, the guy on the, the shuttle bus driver, he yeah. lives there his whole life because he talked a lot. It was like it was like we were, it was like, like we were on a, we were on a tour of Oregon, and he said he said Oregon. So he said Oregon, yeah. and he lives there his whole life. But then, like, it's spelled Oregon. And I feel Oregon. like there are people that are like, huh. if maybe you, like. So I, I figured I had like a a bit when we were driving where I was like, anytime I talk to someone, I'll just say it every different way, and then I'll go, you don't know which way I was fucking around with. I could be like, yeah, I was in Oregon, 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 Oregon. I don't know. How do you say it? I say it the right yeah. One of those is the right way. Which one's correct? A, B, C, D. So I don't know. All the above. But anyway, I went to Oregon. And then, uh. Yeah, see, you said Oregon, Oregon. I guess Oregon. I've said it both. Yeah. I guess it doesn't Because when you say it fast, Oregon. Oregon. Yeah, I Oregon. I hate. I hate Joey I, Harrington, I hate dude. Flying. Quarterback from Oregon. I hate Oregon. Flying. Or seat, go on. The seats suck. Yes. I had to sit in the middle on every flight well, they, besides one. They're slightly they're always getting slightly smaller and they're shit. The worst. Dude, and I have like a I have like problems with like my leg. So like Sciatica. I need to like stretch and like move around and like you just can't. And there's like no arm in space and like there's Wi Fi but like literally doesn't work. You're just like you're connected. And there's yeah. just the Wi Fi is basically saying you're connected to Wi Fi. But don't try to do anything on it, because you can't. Cause I tried to like load a pod because I yeah. didn't pre-download any on the way there. Mistake. Yeah. And then they just don't play. I'm like, okay, cool. So I couldn't listen to anything. I don't. Wa- I watched a movie on the plane. I watched that uh, Sonic movie. Really? It wasn't bad. I mean, it was just fun, a little silly movie, but it wasn't too bad. And then I, I watched half of that uh, uh the Harley Quinn like Birds of Prey movie. Yeah. Uh, that was like that's good. It's actually pretty good. Like of all the, like the Mar the DC movies that I've seen, like this one was actually like decent, not shit. Yeah. But oh, we get there, and we had the shuttle bus driver who's like a tour guide, and he told us to go to this place called Burgerville. I know it was okay, but he was like, man, they've been around since I was a kid. Bark, 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 bark. And so we're like, okay, we go there. And we're like, um, I don't know. What, what what is any? I can't remember like any of them. I got my notes here. If certain things pop up, you know what I mean. We can yap about whatever. Oh yeah, so we up. we like we were like we basically drove around the entire state, almost the country. We literally drove around that. We went like out from Portland, like all the way down, because we went I, like I into California for like we were in California for like we ate like food and like Did a trail. probably the northmost point of California, Crescent City. So we're there, and then. Then we came back up the coast, which is, dude, it's so insane driving up the coast. Like every time we come around, you like come around the corner, there's like trees, but then you come around the corner and it's just ocean and like there's like rocks and stuff. And then you just, I kept doing this every time we come around the corner. I'll go, fuck you. That's my that's my seeing the ocean thing. Cause I've never seen the ocean, before, the Pacific. Yeah, I haven't been over so there. I've seen the Atlantic when we went to Maine. And then I went to the, and I touched both oceans too. So I put my hands in each one. Yeah, because it was too cold to swim. It was like, it was really like when we were in the middle of the state. Like most days, it was like the high. It was like ninety degrees. We're like driving around. The car's like ninety one degrees. Oh Jesus! And then we get out to the coast, and it's like sixty two. Yeah. I'm like, holy shit! I got to put a freaking jacket on. Yeah. I had to put a jack me off on. Yeah. That's all um, that. That's all that wind stuff, you know. But I do have one story. God's out there keeping the fish cold. <laughs> it's, it's just like wide open, so like it's just cool air coming in, I guess. But I, I was like, I kind of wanted to swim in the ocean. God damn it! That's People awesome. talk about all this global warming, man. Get out there in the ocean. Get out the ocean. It's cool. Check, check out the ocean. It's cool. It's cool Ice caps there. are melting. Who's been in the water? Fucking cold out there, dude. Dude, we had a uh, the first place we stayed. So like it's like they advertise like Airbnb. It's like you get your whole you get this full thing. Like okay, cool. And we get there, and it's like we're in like this neighborhood kind of thing, and we're like, okay, well, where's the place? And like we go by the address, and we're like looking at each house, and like it's just like full size houses. And I was like, there's no way we get an entire like four bedroom house. Like, that's yeah. insane. And then we're like, oh, it's right here because yeah. like they have a good description of like oh. It's just, like, the entrance is here, blah, blah, blah. Like, now you'll see the blah, blah, blah. So, like, okay. It describes, like, what you're going to see. And it's, like, this little, like, house apartment thing connected to the back of, like, a full-sized house. 
where like this old couple was just living. Yeah. So like we we're like next to this old couple and we're like, oh, this is weird. Yeah, and like we first separated like, by a wall. Yeah. And like so when you walk in, it's a door. And then on your right side, middle of the night, the guy creeps in. He's like, hey. "Yeah, dude, no, because <laughs> there's a door." You guys haven't set the out <laughs> the outside. And then there, to the door to our little apartment thing was on the right with a little lock, handle yeah. lock. And yeah, then the door to the left was this their house. Yeah. Because like when we went in there, like at one point we like heard that door open, and then we just like and like we're where we have to walk by is like this nice patio area. Yeah. So like oh cool a hangout spot, but like they were just an Airbnb then. Yeah. So, yeah, they were just out like the guy was just out there like sitting on his. I mean it's his patio, but I'm like, so you have guests staying here, but then you're just like hanging out too. Isn't that weird? Yes. Kind of like what are you what are you doing? We had me and uh, Jordan when we were in Tampa, and uh, we had an Airbnb that was like. It was like a, just a big, like a, like a smaller type of house in their backyard. Yeah. And, uh, but they were like, I don't think they were like around. Oh, you didn't say there was like an animal? Like a cat or something like that that you guys saw or a dog? Man, I can't remember. Jordan, Jordan, Jordan would remember that, but she's listening in the future. Yeah. In four years. It's a cat. It was a cute black Chris, you played with it. I tried railing you, and you kept playing with a cat. Dude. I remember. But one of the weird things, another weird thing about it, yeah. is when we first got there, I was, like, in, like, the front room part. So, like, it's, like, right, it's literally, like, sharing walls. And then you just, I just hear music, and it's just, like, and praise be. And it's, just like, and I was, like, dude, why? You're trying to quiet down the like, sex love yeah. sounds. And then later that day, the guy, like, walked outside, and he, like, yeah, I want your donuts. He was like looking at like our car, yeah, like the back of it, and I was like, "What the fuck?" And I was like, "Dude, we're gonna get murdered tonight." Like I honestly was like, "I mean, they have keys. This is their Dude, house." Yeah, what if it was because we like, had the doors locked? But visit. he could easily just visit the yeah. two old people. Shit, Yahtzee! Yeah, you know, dude, shit that, was, the that was pants crazy. And... I don't like what if that. that happen? We're not gonna. I, don't, I want like. I don't when like I, that. when I get Airbnb. Like I don't want to be like on. Like obviously someone you're on else. someone else's property, but like yes. I don't but want you to be him? there. No. Hey, uh, yeah, we're gonna be in the other room. Yeah. <laughs> we're gonna be listening to Jesus stuff. And like it had like there was a sign on the patio that said like, oh, what did it say? It was like patio one or something like that. Like something like that to me signified, oh, this is like where you hang out. But then, whoa, uh oh, we might have a cat fight. Chill out, cats. Cat. Chris is gonna might have to get up and go um, interrupt a cat fight. Yeah, I don't like that either with the whole but like, room thing. But they were – the old people were out there the whole time, almost. They kept, like, going out to someone, like, so we're not going to hang out there because I'm not hanging out with them. Like, that's crazy. Diesel. Diesel's worried. All right. Diesel – Chris said it's fine. Um – uh, yeah, I gotta get this off my chest. I have a huge uh, anxiety problem right now. I didn't put my phone in airplane mode, so our video could cut at any moment. <laughs> oh yeah, oh, whatever. <laughs> it just scares me because it happened before, and people have called my phone, and then it immediately fucks up the video. Oh, so but, if we, we made all the comments, if we get, yeah, <laughs> if we only got 13 minutes of video, then I guess that's all we got. But we'll see. Uh, so yeah, Dude. sharing a house with Yahtzee, old guy. Yeah, and then. Let me, let me get creepy crawler grandma. But like they were like they were like outside, I think, doing like yard work or something when we were leaving the next morning. So I was just like, we gotta get to the car. Yeah. Then, <laughs> like, hey, got, so how's it? No, yeah. I didn't want this. We did see the guy one time. We like walked up the day we got there. We yeah. like went to get food and we walked by because he was like sitting out there and we just like, and he's like, hey, how's it going? And I'm like, hey, how you how you doing? And then I was like, as much as I'm like, Jesus. And then we're like in our car, and I'm like, we go to a restaurant, and I'm just the whole time like, dude, I could like eat so just be rifling through all of our shit. Like this is like, oh yeah, head. yeah. I like, dude, there was a. Uh, I don't like that either. We like stopped off to do this cool hike, and we pull in, and there's like a weird truck, like it like looks so like some like utility truck, but like yeah. old, like it was a utility truck, and then some guy bought it, yeah. and he was like, no, oh, this is just my truck now. And it was just full of shit. And then some girl, like, in a shittier SUV. And then us pull up. And then we get out. And we're just, like, walking. And we're, like, about to just hike. And I'm just, like, I mean, what? Are, I'm, like, the whole time I'm, like, they could easily just smash out our fucking window, steal our shit, yeah. and then leave. Yeah. And I'm just, like, 
I just in my head, I'm like, that's so annoying. Like, we can't actually, what we were doing, we had all of our valuable shit, like, in our backpacks, and yeah. we literally took our backpacks everywhere. So I took my hiking bag with my iPad yep. in it and stuff. And that, even when we were going on hikes, I put that my, sucks. I had everything with me. So, like, even if they, like, broke into the car, I'm like, hey, take the clothes. Because it was all clothes and soap. Yeah, it'd be not great. Yeah. But, like, I would have just been annoyed. This is my rental car, and then you just punch the window out. Now I have to deal with this problem. Like so, like that's just in my head the whole time, and I can't even like. But then that's more people, people like pull, more people like pulled up and parked, so it was kind of like yeah. okay, people would be stupid now, because like I know me if I like pulled up somewhere and I just saw someone punch out a window, I'd go okay, well I'm calling the police now. Yeah. Especially but, if they were white. Yeah, dude. White people going down. Right. Um, I have a uh, I have a flat tire story, but if you wanted to tell your uh, your grandpa, grandpa road rage, you do a flip flop flip. Yeah, a car um, story. Dude, I car ran, for start, start when car I had car to story. break up the cat fight, it wasn't a cat fight. Severus, the black cat's trying to like sleep on the soft blanket in, in the living room. And Buddy has a bit of a uh, humping problem where he wants oh, to that's his blanket? hump. No, he wants to hump the cats. Oh. He wants to fuck Diesel. Diesel and Bear are big, round, plump cats. And Buddy is like, these are prime for plowing. And he's trying to plow a cat. So... I had to throw them. Sometimes uh, the cats kind of understand. I'll throw them on top of this tower we got, and I'll, and basically like time out, and they'll stay up there. I think they like. You know, I like to think that they're disciplined, but also it's probably that they go okay yeah, right. and lay down. All right, whatever. But it's I so like buddy think, is trying to fuck several. Buddy, yeah, he's fucking all the cats. Jeez. If we let him outside, he'd be there'd be a ton of he's him. just raping animals. Little buddies running around the neighborhood. The news. We have a serial rapist. Like you could be on like animal news, like the squirrels. Would yeah, be he, their, they'd the have squirrels would be on their te- uh, trees watching TV. What, what's the fuck that guy? What what the fuck? Is, what's the fuck? That guy's name, uh, Christopher Hansen. <laughs> He'd be Chris Hansen. Yeah, Chris Hansen. Christopher. Christopher. I don't think anyone's calling Christopher. Hansen. I don't think anyone named dude, Chris that, is called Christopher. Of rape, that dude, you know the Drake and Josh. Yeah, that Drake Bell guy. I heard that. Too. Yeah, he's like he's like. I heard arrested. that from my new hire that I've been training at work. One of the first things he's talking to me is like, yeah, man, it's crazy. Did you hear about Drake Bell? And I was like, so, what? Yeah, like, I'm not super, like, but it's funny because I, on my tick, like, on TikTok, I'll get, like, that Josh guy has one, and he'll, like, post, like, funny, well, yeah. funny, he, fun, I mean, they're not that funny. Yeah. And it'll just come up. So every time, but every time I see him, I go, huh, oh, the other I guy. Yeah, I never see the other guy. And then literally, he's I saw, had, like, a he video like, drug where he's, like, and shit. Yeah, he's like in trouble because he was like for grooming and shit. Like he was like grooming like a twelve year old yeah. back in the day, and I'm just like, yeah, yeah. yeah. I but, didn't read in, but like this is the problem. I didn't read into it, so now I'm just regurgitating this. And it's, what if it's just like it was one person and like she's lying or something? You know what yeah, I mean? Yeah. You don't know. So yeah. like, but I didn't look into it. Which but, has happened to Ben Roethlisberger and Kobe Bryant. You know, it was only ever one person, and uh, they weren't paid off. It was just a lie. Okay. Um. So. I don't know if I should share. I have videos, and I, dude, it was so hard the day of finding out about this. I found out about this. What the hell? This is getting I found me, out this about is getting this. Getting all revved up. Uh, Wednesday. Okay. So when I was on vacay, it happened Tuesday night. I wanted to tell you guys, you and some of the boys down at the ships down and at the boats. Sh- down at the shipping yard. The ships and the boats. Shout out. That's what uh. The end of uh, ODB song. So shout out to the ships and the boats and sub- uh, submarines and stuff. What about so, those? Yeah. Shout out. How about this? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Oh. The quick. YouTube video is going to get brought down because I said she. Quick. Right. Uh, just a quick interruption. Dude, there's just. We, me and Jen got on this. I did. I got on a rant of like. The, every time there's cool new lingo and people just say it. Yeah. And I'm just like. Like. I, people could like be like, oh, you're just, oh, you're too cool to say that stuff. Oh. And I'm just like, no, but li- listen to it this no. way. Let's say nobody's saying any. Let's say the, uh, um, what's something? Like Yeet. Yeah, Yeet, or, or, Yeet was a or, big thing. Or this shit's while. bussin'. Like that thing. Yeah. Let's pretend no one said that. And I start walking around going, this shit bussin'. People will go, what? Yeah. You just, you make shit up, you fucking weirdo. But because it's a cool thing. Because, yeah, because seventeen-year-olds run around saying it. Yeah, because most of the time, let's be honest, most of the time, black people say something, yeah. and then white people are losers and steal it. Yeah. Let's be honest. Yeah, black people are cooler than white people, and white people steal everything they say. Yeah, 
So whatever. But anyway, we were next to this. It's well guy. documented. We're eating food at the airport, and this guy's on the phone. He walks by. He's like, <laughs> and he's just and he's talking like a fucking idiot. He's, talking he's just like, he's the a mean... whitest guy I've ever seen. And I'm like, God. you're a fucking loser. And you had to go to Portland to see it. This is at the Seattle airport. All right. But I mean, they're both well, same place. Pretty hipstery. <laughs> it's not the same. One is the Seahawks. The other one's got the yeah. Timberwolves. Portland, the was, Portland was just Timber hipstery team. central, dude. Yeah. It was. It was like we saw a lot of people in wheelchairs, and by a lot, I don't mean it was just like wheelchairs everywhere. But it was like so. I should go there as soon as I get my leg replaced. It was like how often are you walking around? And you just see like a mobility scooter, like not that often. It's not like you're like oh, there's one. There's but it was just like Why? there's one. There it was. There were like. People weren't like overweight, were they? Is it like? No, it was like fucked up people, like people that like couldn't walk, or, like injured, like they weren't fat people. Why are there so many? They were either old or like they only had one leg, or what's going on? But it was like it wasn't like Is there a bomb when somewhere? I when I say this, it wasn't like you would see like ten over there. You would see like one, and then you'd walk on the block, just turn another block, keep seeing one, and then we go in a coffee one, shop, two. and we look over, and there's another one. Yeah, you'd see like one, and then like ten, twenty, thirty minutes later, you see another one, and you're kind of like like it was. Just enough to you, because even Jen goes, why are there so many wheelchairs? And I was like, I don't know. That's weird. Like, before she said it, and then, like, when she said it, it kind of, like, clicked. And I went, yeah, there's a lot of yeah, wheelchairs. Yeah. What the fuck? But, like, it was, like, wheelchair a lot of wheelchair down. people. And then, like, a lot of young, like, young slash, like, hipstery people. You know, like, oh, like, you just have weird clothes on and weird hair and weird piercings. Oh, why is it all weird? Because it... It's just weird. It's just weird. Like, you got, you're you got trying. To, shut the fuck up because you're trying to be different. Now you shut the fuck up. Yeah, but, like, yeah, people yeah. telling me that. Yeah. You want to be weird. Yeah. Don't say, oh, why is it weird? Because you're going for that. If it well, wasn't weird and eccentric and cool to be, oh, look at my fucking pants that are, like, tight around all, my waist. But they're, say. like, baggy. Th- they're huge. But, like, they fit. They'll but have they don't plaid, fit. Yeah. And then the, the jacket will have, like, stars. Yeah. So it's like, first off, no one has ever done that. That doesn't look good. It'll never will look good. Yeah, like, you got a jacket full of stars and then plaid pants. Yeah, like, like <sighs> you're, you're purposely like, look, it's ironically good because these things don't match. These patterns not, don't match. Not that I have a problem. Like, I don't care. Wear whatever you want. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm allowed to comment on but stuff. I, yeah, but I'm allowed to go. And I'm allowed to observe and make fun of it because that's what I do. I observe things and I make fun of things. And I don't really care, but I just think it's funny. Yeah. So, yeah. And then, or... Like there were like there's, just like there's, there's actually old, zero passion. And then like you would see like whatever. a random like parents and their kid, and then like old people. Yeah. And then crazy homeless people, of course. And they smelled. Nice. We walked. Jen would be. Like, Jen was like, we were in the car. And she goes, Ugh. every time we walked by, like my nose yeah. was kind of stuffy, so I didn't get it as bad. But like every time we walked by, someone Jen was like, you still got the ramifications of COVID. But yeah, yeah, I was, I was I was suffering through COVID on yeah. the trip the whole time. But the whole time, I've actually had it for three. You're months spreading straight. the Delta variant. Yeah, I have the Delta variant, but I've, you got it I've from been vaccinated. The Delta, you got it from the so Delta. It's form. not as bad. Yeah, Delta gives you Delta variant. Yeah, you got it. Love Delta. Love the Delta. Actually, plus. I do love Delta. Yeah, they're probably. I mean, they gotta be the best. Uh, anyway, yeah. okay. Uh, Grandpa. Uh, yeah. I don't know what, what we, whatever got me on that. We're, head, we're wild, you know. Is the trees? We're jumping off tree branches. Yeah. Um, which that episode it was good. It was funny. I was trying to tell Drew because yeah. our buddy Drew likes like four like comedians and <laughs> and Corey. I like and I, more than that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and Corey and I love like a shit ton. Like I keep, oh, I constantly find oh, out got, more. I you like. You know everything about oh, comedy. You just know all of them. Yeah. And uh, like no, I just uh, I try to spread the joy. Yeah, I'm like I think that. This person they don't all them. say faggot, so you can calm down. Yeah, but like, <laughs> like, uh, actually, like none of them do. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like Mark Norman once every a million episodes and of then podcasts. The come town guys. Yeah, like, those aren't guys that we're recommending to anybody. The one come the town one? guy. Yeah, yeah, the other right. two don't even. Yeah, the two go. Well, like Styles, <laughs> the other two are trying to. Like Styles, like I mean, I like do shows and I'm trying to do other things, so I yeah. don't want to say. I was on the Burt cast. Yeah. You know, but anyway, trying yeah. to get on bigger yeah, but I, I don't. That's probably the one podcast. Honestly, that'd be the podcast where I go, "Oh, what are you listening to?" And I would go, "Uh, I mean, you don't want to listen to it no, <laughs> for sure." If I'm, if I'm at work, I flip my phone if I'm listening oh, to God. it because someone. Dude, I did this on the airplane. I, so you know, how, like, you, it just says "come down." So you go like this, right? Here, let me just do it real quick. 
some like lady at my work is like so comes up to comes to my desk and my phone says come town on it all right after happen. this i promise she's gonna get to the story but i want to tell one quick story about the flight <laughs> yeah. we're on the flight and this fucking so like you know like you can pay a little bit extra to pick your seats yeah so jen likes to do that because she likes to sit in the aisle because she doesn't want to be crammed in the middle because it's like you know people yeah. have anxieties whatever yeah so she, likes, like she, likes, too. she likes to pick the aisle seat. So we pay, and it's like insane amounts of money. You yeah. pay like 15 more dollars or whatever, yeah. 10 more dollars. And then... It's reasonable. It's like whatever. It's To me, she like asks me, is it fine? And I just go, I don't care. Pay, whatever. It's a little bit more. It's yeah. not going to affect... I'm not going to be like, oh, now i got to fucking sell the dog. Like, it's fine. <laughs> so we pay for our seats. And then... They switch our, They switch the flight, and that mixes all the seats up. So me and Jen look, and we're both in the middle seats in two different aisles. Boom, boom. Yeah. And so Jen, there's still open seats, so she changes it, but she changed it to where I'm. A, she's on the aisle, and I'm on the window. Okay, cool. And then there was an empty seat in between us. But I guess for a moment, this family, like, yes. mom, dad, and an eight, an eight and a half year old son, because that's what the guy said to this lady. I'm an eight they're and a half they're sitting son. middle, so one next to me, one in front of me, and then one in front of that row. So it's middle, middle, middle. That's how their seats were. Which, I get it. If I was eight years old, I don't really want to sit in between strangers. So they were like, hey, can our, can we switch, whatever. So the girl that was in front of us, she moved to the middle in between us. Yeah. So <laughs> I'm like, all right, I'm going to start a pot. And I go pull up, and I have I go to browse, and I had downloaded one. Or not browse. Yeah, yeah. I went to my library, and I had the downloaded ones. So download it, and then when you like, like when you click play, and you have it open like yeah, that, yeah. it's just the full title. And I'm literally sitting here going, and I think it, my phone was either like freezing or fucking up, and I'm just going play, 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 and I'm smack, and like my phone's just like this, and you, you know, playing. She's literally like her head's here, and I don't, like, I don't want to look at her see if she's looking, but I'm like, I know me. If someone pulls her phone out, I just inherently I just, go, yeah, I inherently just inherently look down. Yeah. Oh, what are they? I saw it. she played games. Like I didn't yeah. want to. What is she doing? I, she just would go bring her phone out, and I would look over. So I'm like, she just sees come town, and then she was like, "What is this piece of shit next to me? Is this like a porn thing? Is he like a fucking freak?" Oh, so then in my head, I'm like, "Oh god, well hopefully good she good thing li- we got our kid away. Hopefully she listens to it, man. and maybe she finds out. I'm like, oh, hopefully she doesn't listen to it. That might be even worse." Yeah, it started. So then I'm like, Dude, start, but starts yeah. it, and he's like, "Jew, Jew, Jew." Back to my point. Yeah. That's a pod where. 99% of the people would go, "What are you listening to?" I would go, "Ah, no, just a podcast." I wouldn't even want to say the name because they would go, "What?" Yeah, music. And then you, yeah. You walk uh, what do you listen to? Uh, I listen to guys suck each other's dicks. It's just the sound. <laughs> uh, listening to Revolutions, a history podcast. You just say. Yeah. Listening to uh, Dan's Hardcore History. Oh really? I love that episode. What episode are you on? You're like, uh, uh what's the name? Uh, Kangas uh, Khan. The one about uh, part two. I love it. Oh fuck! Stop, Stop talking. Uh, to me. <laughs> ah, I'm, I'm listening to guy fuck his dog. <laughs> like, what? Listening to Bert fuck dogs. All right. Um. Chris has a story. I'll send you guys the video, like you and them, videos. the videos. Yeah. Um. So, like, my uh, uncle tells me the story. He goes, hey, did you know that your, uh, your grandpa, like, um, he, he got into, like, a like a road rage incident. And I'm immediately thinking, because oh, I know, so he drives a little, he's a speed guy, yeah. a speedy dude. Uh. He's 73, but he fucking, like, floors it. He might hit a curb, you know? And so he's, like, he's driving wild. Uh, And who knows? Like, sometimes we think in the family, like, maybe this dude drives a little crazier ever since Grandma passed. Uh, he's His like, wife. Maybe he's, like, been, like... I don't give a shit. He has said some things, but we're, like, that is depressing. Um, Do you need to talk? Let's talk. You know, yeah. need to see somebody. And you need to do some get some hobbies to, like... That's a big hole in your life or whatever. Yeah. But he – so apparently he was taking a – you know, like a car was taking a right turn and he's in the left. I think it might have been vice versa. But like I don't think – I mean the story I heard was that like he sort of went in front of the guy when maybe like he should have like let the guy go and then he went. Uh, So – but he says – he as I talked to him, I actually – Went to his house for like a minute and talked to him. But he uh, he said, oh, I didn't do anything wrong. I just blah, blah, blah. So I think, if anything, it was like, a, you know, you're like, well, we're not just going to crash into each other. Someone's got to go. Yeah. And so he probably just floored it and went because he, that, he is more inclined 
in his, in his history of driving to just floored and go. So he, I'm sure he kind of cut this guy off, right? And he doesn't know. Uh, he has um, a grandchild, a granddaughter in his back seat, and she's in like you know her, she's in a little seat. She's oh, only, your grandpa does. Yeah, she's mm-hmm. only like five, and uh, maybe four. I don't know. We're all maybe six. I don't know. It doesn't matter. So he. He doesn't know. He's just thinking, like, I'm going to go pick up a Coke at this gas station. So he pulls over. He doesn't know that this guy is so livid. He's just following from, him. Yeah, he's just following him. So this guy's What a psycho. Yeah. First I off, mean, first off, you're nuts. We've all thought about... Dude, I should... Like, you, we all we thought, thought about, about following the, we people. We thought about the steps. But you, but just, you don't even do step one, which yeah, is you just fully You just go, him. man, I want to follow this guy and fucking whatever. This guy did a bunch of steps. Yeah. This guy follows him. Um, He... He... he uh. So there's a couple videos, and I, at first I had to watch them all to like figure out which one came first, because I got them like. Who's making videos? People in, people in the fucking like. Luckily for Frank Grandpa, luckily for his sake, because he's pressing charges on this guy and stuff. So he he pulls over. Um, he's about to get out of his car to go just grab a coke, and so he, this is where one video starts. He opens the car door and. It's this lady and the guy. They're both probably like 30 to... I mean, the girl might be a little younger, but it's like 30 to 35. These guys, so young. So young, yeah. a dude who could like kill a person. You know, and he's not a small dude. He's like he's like kind of a taller he's guy. beat him an old man. Yeah, and then the old man, guys, is 73. That, that's, that's how old the grandpa is. And so... He opens his car door because he's about to get out, and then, and he's also, I mean, he's had so many surgeries. Yeah, I've seen him before. He's had so many surgeries on his shoulders and he's, all he's over his damn body. Stiff as a board. <laughs> yeah, reconstructive <laughs> surgery everywhere. He's like a robot, and he, yeah, he's like fucking having a hard time getting in and out of trucks yeah. and and just moving in general. Like he starts off a little more hunched, and he kind of like straightens yeah. out. Like so that that's the mindset. How insane you got to be to to want to do anything so, even like let's say i even pass step one where i'm like i'm gonna follow this guy i see this guy get out of yep. the car i go ah. dude how about this i got t-boned by a person not even as old and i in my head i was thinking i'm going to murder this old motherfucker i got t-boned hard dude my car almost flipped and shit oh, yeah. it's like a transformer scrapped the whole side of the the, the car i had a little escort i got wrecked and the other side hit a sign. I got out of that car and I was like, I'm going to murder this guy. And then I like recognized the guy. Also, I wasn't going to murder an yeah, old guy. Right. I, you're, I'm just angry. You're going to create but I so been much like, more problems I would have just calmed down and been like, oh, what the hell? I, have, uh, I, I see like these TikToks where like it's just people like yelling at each other. I just saw one today. So yeah, those guys were like fishing. A bunch. And there's two guys on kayaks who are clearly drunk. We're like, are you guys talking shit? And like, I don't know if there's like more to the story, but whatever. Everyone's like a monkey. <laughs> but, like, like, oh, but when you look at the comments, dude, there's just so many comments. Like people are like, "Why don't you defend yourself?" And then I'm like, "You're an idiot." Because then people like I read a comment going, "No, you're st- like, you shouldn't escalate. A def- you should never escalate, dude." In this situation, uh, wait, continue. In this in this situation, defending myself, uh, defending himself. If my grandpa had a gun, well, uh, yeah. How crazy this is. Like, this ends up getting like this. This guy. Like, that's another thing. Like, don't do that. Especially like an old white dude in an F-150, like this guy might have a fucking gun oh, yeah, right dude. there. Every, you run up to his car door, which is what happened. The, the the lady, so he has his car door open, and he went to, so they're yelling at him. They're like, we have a kid in our car. And he's like, I have a kid in my car. Yeah. Like, I'm not, neither car got tapped. We weren't rolling on the street. You know, it was like, you're really mad about something. You're basically like someone didn't use a turn signal, and you're like, I'm following this motherfucker home yeah. and attacking him. So he shuts his car door. They go to start opening it. Both of them. The, the door, and then the girl is weird, because the girl was screaming at him, like at Grandpa. But then this also... Th- so this was filmed immediately? Well, no. The, 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 he cut him off. He cut him off, like, down the road yeah. or whatever the fuck. And then he ended up turning into a gas station, and then... When so, did like the video start? So, my grandpa parks. Yeah. These two, this couple are getting out of the car, and they're like, I don't know what the fucking word is. They're insane. And so they get out and they're yelling and screaming. So someone just I have, just, a, I have someone's, a word. Someone's pulling their phone out because they're acting yeah. insane. Okay, yeah. I mean, because it's quick. People are quick. They're like, 
It's not even video. that. They're probably scream. They're probably fucking screaming, and they're parking, and they're, they're, they're clearly they drove in there all crazy. Yeah. So like, they they started the video after people were going nuts. Okay. And then they started the video, and, and they're walking up to this old white dude. Who, you don't know if this guy has a gun. You know, I would never do this. Being a, even a white dude, I'm not gonna run up to an old no. white dude in F-150. I'm running up to nobody. Nobody. Ever. But I'm just like, saying, these people now lately, because of the Trump stuff, it's like everyone definitely has guns. My mom, my mom took her CP. She doesn't have yeah. a gun, but she took the class. Yeah, old white lady. So she could have a gun. Guns. And stuff. I have two guns. Yeah. So, dude. So, yeah, they're lucky he didn't have something. He's That's taking saying, cl- man. I think he's taking dude, classes. Dude, I've said, to, I'll say it to be like, I've been with like friends. I've been with like people. Like, I'm just like, I, I mean, like, I'll have road rage where I'm like in my car screaming, but like as soon as like I'll hear people go like beep beep, like honk the horn, or like I'm just like, dude, you do. Just shut up. Yeah. Because, dude, what that fucking guy gets out and shoots both of us? And I'm dead because I'm in the car with you. Yeah, yeah. I so, just, when it comes to, like, outwardly, like, I'm going after this guy. You're an idiot. Yeah. So, yeah, they're clearly nuts. So, he shuts his door. Diesel. The guy goes to open it again. The lady, even though she was screaming at him and calling him an idiot, you didn't hurt our kid. Even though it doesn't know him. No one flipped or nothing. Yeah, so, yeah, sorry. Oops. Um, And... So she is trying to stop her dude from opening the car back door back open. What also was funny is I'm like, the car door's open. And now that he shuts it, you're like angry and you want to open it. I don't know. It's so weird. So he's yelling the shit and he's backing up. And then, um, so that's one video. They start walking back away to their car. There's another video of the guy. So it's all from the same guy. The guy... He just recorded several videos. He puts his phone down so that he doesn't get murdered by this dude who's yeah, yeah. trying to murder people. Yeah. And he puts his phone down. They walk back to the car. So, as I can tell where the, the building's over here, this happened to the side of the building. Frank's now like, well, I'm not getting a Coke. I'm backing up and I'm going to leave. So he backs up and he rolls his window da- windows down and he's just driving out. And the, the, the couple again are screaming at him again. And the guy starts walking up to the car and he has his window down and Frank's just like, Old dude, I have this video just as he throws a punch and he threw a punch and punched like my grandpa in the face. Oh. Uh while he's in the car. Yeah, that guy's fucked. And <laughs> yeah, this guy's definitely fucked. Dude. It's all it's on video. <laughs> Him screaming, looking like a maniac. Looking oh, like he wants to rip him a seventy three year old guy. Idiot. You're a moron. You look like you want to kill somebody. Uh. You can't just go punching faces. Yeah, dude. And that video looks so bad because it's all the all bad. Video. And then even the two videos, because he's trying to he's get trying away. He's trying to leave. And Old you, cases. Dude, that guy is fucked. Yeah, and it's all on video. <laughs> and dude, doesn't that make? That's kind of makes me laugh. Like, I would love for like to be there and go. <laughs> you just kind of like laugh. You're an idiot. Oh yeah, so yeah be okay there for though? like the trial and good? be like, you're an idiot. He, yeah, I was talking to him. He was fine. I mean, he's. Uh, yeah, I mean he's, he's, he's like, normal he as he's always anything. been. Uh, he had like a little, uh, like a little blue mark on his cheek. So that guy's kind of like a pussy too. I mean, it looked like he got him, but also Frank like looked back like, uh, "Are you serious?" He, uh, right after the video, like in the video, so right not only are you it, fucked, then now there's a video of you punching an old man and doing almost no damage. Yeah, I don't. It's <laughs> it's nuts. And uh, I mean, think about it. An old man, you should fucking like. If you connect with an old guy, you're gonna. How Shouldn't are you not drop? breaking his jaw? <laughs> yeah. Like, it's they're old. Their bones aren't that that good. He's had a million surgeries. Ah, yeah. oh, I, I mean, like, I feel like I got loud and wacky on that one, but that's, that's but that's crazy. But dude, uh, I gotta see wild. this video. Yeah. You, so like the guy was like, it. "Hey, I have the video." I don't know. I guess. Oh wow. He, he sent them all. My like, entire family had the videos like immediately. That <laughs> <night>. <laughs> Everyone's like passing it around. Maybe the guy was like, "Frank." Yeah, <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, but Pissing? but how? So people so often at like uh, you know at concerts and comedy shows and certain things people get upset. They're like, oh, our phones are ruining things, and it's like this is like certain things like this. It's like somebody yeah, things are getting documented. Yeah, things are getting documented immediately. It's so easy for someone to have a clear and good video. The guy's face What's is this? all over the video. So fast. Yeah, he. He, video. Yep. Recording. I'm making a video right now. He turns around. Er, er. He turns around and his face is right there too. And yeah. I'm like, man. Oh, and then they, another video is the car. Right after they do that, they go, <laughs> and pull and peel out of the 
gas station, and you can see their license plate. So the guy got the license plate, guy got the face. Dude, uh, I'm picturing that guy getting arrested, and you're just like, the whole time, so like, the whole time you just want to be there going, God, you're an idiot. That much rage? It made I mean, me, how much rage me. he had? It made me think like, you can. Is have, he, does he have a little bit of something? He has to have a problem. You don't just do that, and you you don't have some type of problem. It's an old dude. You can't yeah, even. You can, at no point you've thought rational thoughts. You've been like, hitting the head a lot. You played football. So you de- like don't get, like don't get me wrong. I, when it comes to road rage, I'm pretty bad. You can ask Jen. Yes, but like I'm, I'm in I'm my never car, out of going, the car. I want to kill this person. This person. I want death. Like I'll say insane shit, and I'm yelling and whatever. But there, I would never. Oh, this person cut me off. I'm gonna follow them yeah. and then punch them in the face. Because guess what? Who's going to jail? Me. Yeah. You gotta think about the ramifications. You can't just no. do whatever you want. Especially uh, in this case. Oh my god. At a gas station. You know how many people are at gas stations? Like in Taylor. Yeah, man. It's gas station. I mean, there's people everywhere. Like the Telegraph or whatever. I'm sure it was like around there somewhere. It's like. Yeah. Uh, Someone filmed it. There's people everywhere yeah. on Telegraph. There's an infinite amount of people everywhere. There's more videos. There's, there probably is. There's probably a few people who just put it right to their story and like, old guy got fucked or whatever. <laughs> old guy gets fucked. <laughs> I see it on TikTok. I'm like, huh. Yeah. You like tell me later. I'm like, oh, I think I saw that video. <laughs> yeah. I saw it on Dude, I just saw this on Instagram. I saw this on, I saw I this just on fucking Barstool. I do that for Dude, I saw this on, uh, uh, what's his name? Fucking UFC guy. What the fuck is his name? Who posts like all those people getting fucked up? Oh, <laughs> he's okay. Yeah, yeah, he's okay. I see, he's okay. It's your, it's your grandma beast. getting punched. In, yeah. What the fuck? This has never happened in my life. Oh my god. Uh, sh- shiitake mushrooms. Shitoka. Uh, he's a name. Daryl? No, he's not Asian. Ah, oh, whatever. His name is the Beast. Uh, I wonder. You know what's funny? We don't do this often. I think we're afraid of the silence sometimes. Um, was listening to a podcast with Rick Glassman, and he had Ali Makovsky on. Oh, no. And he just had one with the uh, Anders. Yeah, well, I was going to check those out probably at some point. I don't know. It all depends. Sometimes other things are be- seem better, and I'm like, oh, I guess I'll never get to it. Yeah, Rick but Glassman was funny. Rick Glassman's a funny dude. He's like weirdly, oddly, literally self-aware, and it's always like a silly, uh, sort of autistic time. And uh, that's what I got. I've seen like I saw like a there was like a clip him and like Esther did like a little pod for like a minute, yeah. and like their back and forth was like really funny because she's just like this like I don't know, and then he's just like tiny. and he just like how he says stuff is just so good. So him and Makovsky, Makovsky. Allie, this comedian, she works very slowly. That's her, her tone. I am doing you, buddy. She uh, wide load. The way she just gets things out are slow, and Rick is always like incredibly quick. Yeah, he's always just like, and then what do you think about that? And then what about this? And then he just answers everything quick, or he asks questions immediately. And, she, and she's just trying to like get to something and uh she keeps getting worried that the pod's bad and then right. rick glassman's like comfortable and just sitting in the in the silent silence i was trying to do it like you know just chilling and uh you know letting a thought sit think about it for a second the viewer doesn't turn isn't going to turn it off just because you went and then the guy well i, I would no just kidding. quick but quick everyone's turned out turned out but I just thought that was funny. They're talking about the silence, and I was like, oh, sometimes we just go wild to watch stuff for all these. But the quick and stuff, the quick. My son! Quick back to back jumping off tree branches is fun. Yeah. That's Tim, uh, Tim. Joe and Mark Norman do that all the time. Joe Norman and Mark List. Joe List. Oh, wait, that's his real name. We're. So yeah, that thing happened. He's pressing charges. The cops called him like that night, or whatever the who whoever the fuck calls you, and they're asking him about it. And uh, you want to push charges? And he's like, fuck, fuck yeah, brother, I got the tape. I think I do. God, I got a it. tape here. And uh, the video, I haven't seen it, but it sounds like it makes 
That's two different clips. The, like, one main clip is they're freaking out trying to oh, shut open the door. You just see like an bunch. old guy going like. And then the next one is he's dri- like they walked away. The next one he's driving away, and then he has his window down. The guy's like, just runs up to the window and throws a punch, and then like, the whole time, it's like back and forth. The lady is like, the lady goes to like hold her dude back, and then she looks like she wants to do something, and then she's like, no, Bobby, or whatever, hold him back, and then she wants, she's like, fuck yeah, punch him or whatever. It's like, I'm like, you guys, you guys. Get on some something? Or back and forth loud. But also, uh That's crazy. Also, also uh what did I tell you about? It's kind of embarrassing, I think. People don't openly talk about uh OnlyFans subscriptions. <laughs> but so, check it out. Someone posted like a like some model I follow on Instagram. Uh-huh. Posted that she's got some shit for free. Oh, yeah. And I went, all right. For free, I'll check something out. So I check it out, and, like, so she's, like, a gorgeous model. But she always looks like, um, like, I don't know. But So she posts this. I mean, the OnlyFans yeah, was Joe list and my normal one was free. Yeah, so her, her OnlyFans were... Well, because when we think about women, you're thinking about certain things. Yeah, no, no, I get it. I'm just saying. It was the same of her, it was the same as her Instagram. Yeah. And I'm going through it, going. Some people pay. Some people pay for this. And like you see, like the num- they got like all these numbers and stuff, and it's like, and then uh, I'm like, I wonder how many. And then it's like, if you want to see this or that, you have to pay, and it's like, oh, so people are paying a subscription. This is, Jordan's got a podcast upstairs. Oh God, so loud. Her. Yeah, I thought she was just. I thought she was just having an argument with nothing. Yeah, arguing with somebody while she's showering. Yeah. Look, if you don't get those TPS <laughs> reports in by Saturday. This is what I'm going to say to Chris later. And yeah, she's practicing yelling at me. <laughs> and, um. So it was wild because you have to. Cl- you'd have to. You so you subscribe. Say if you did pay monthly for these people, then they ask you to pay for to get vi- the other videos. I was like. That's bull crap. And then I was like, is that like a, that's almost like a scam. You think you're subscribing, you're getting stuff. Yeah. You're subscribing to like get teasers. Well, I've seen stuff. Yeah, I've seen the ones where they have like a, a, like it'll be like a pro, like like the profile will say like, I haven't, like it'll be like you subscribe, like you pay for the subscription, but then like it'll say like, there's no paywalls. Because I think, uh, I think like they'll do like, you can even, I think the ones we even do like, you pay, and then you get like you know, like here's my tits. Yeah. But then like, then sometimes I'll post like a video. But like now, when you have to like unlock it with money or yes. something, so then I'm like, I didn't know that. What? I didn't know that's how it worked. I kind of thought like, oh, you subscribe and you check stuff out. Yeah, because I I just I see I see like I always see like in the profiles. They'll so say, they're like, really getting guys. They'll say like no, yeah, because they're getting people to subscribe, and, and then, then it's like, like look if you want to see the full ten minute video, like they'll show you ten seconds. Yeah, and you're like, oh, she's in a bikini. Oh, it's over. <laughs> and then you're like, what the fuck? What is it? And then 50, 50 the ten minutes could just be her walking around in a bikini. I mean, literally yeah. nothing's even happening. But you were like, I gotta see if something you happens. Got, you got, sca- you got. And it's just horny ass dudes. It's a uh, you know, you gotta pay twenty two. I don't even know what the price is. But dude, I did this. I went. You know what? I'm already here. Hack. I was on only. <laughs> I was on OnlyFans. I'm already here. Um, I but- just got a raise. <laughs> <laughs> I just got a raise. I was like, I was thinking of cock. My uh, cock just raised, yeah, and that, I got a raise. That, that too. So I just got my bonus. Yeah, I'm already here. I just got some throwaway I'm money. I'm not helping the porn hub, okay? I'm here. Yeah. I'm like, all right, well, she didn't deliver. She's got nothing on her page. I'm going to go to, like, a porn star that I know, that I know, I know personally, no, that I know of, right? <laughs> She's got to have good stuff. I go to one. The subscribe is like five bucks. I was like, whatever, I'm doing this. <laughs> five bucks paid. And then on her account, I'm like, oh, this is going to be sweet. Uh, and then she's got like some videos. And I <laughs> just check out one. And it's fucking 17 seconds of nothing. She's like, I'm going to do this and I'm going to do that. And I'm like, nice. And then it's like, da, 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 to unlock the video. No! What? And, and everything. And it show, so her thing, it says, we got 900 photos, or <clears throat> 9,000 photos, and we have 
198 videos. And I'm like, damn, that's a shit ton of videos. And that's why I was like, five bucks? Okay. Yeah. 198 videos. Every single video is not even 10 seconds long. Oh, just, you have to unlock So that's them? like a lie. You, you, people see 200 plus videos or whatever. You're like, oh, nice. I'm paying yeah, for see, a Yeah, see, I think that's why some of them say, we'll say in the bio, there's no paywall. Because like, people will be like, well, I'm not. I think everyone's doing paywalls, dude. I bet you if, if someone doesn't have paywalls, it's a couple people. And yeah, and then maybe. they're not really showing anything, I bet you. I bet you they're not showing shit. Hmm. Yeah, they're, that's fucked up. They don't have a paywall because they're not doing anything. It's just showing like yeah. half a nip. Dude, that's Which retarded. is an Instagram. Yeah, that's stupid. So people, <laughs> horny, goofy guys, I beware. Yeah, yeah. There's paywalls. Past the paywall. Already got my one paywall. That's what I'm saying. What the fuck? Man, they're getting people out there. I'm like, geez. I'm basically giving you five dollars a month so I could give you fifteen dollars per video. Yeah, I was like, fuck this. I'll never check anyone's out again. Oh man. And just immediately like did unfollow whatever the fuck you do on there, and I was like, whatever. I was like that. There's a fucking bug. Kill it. It was over in front of me. Oh! So, I missed it twice. It's just, I was like, man, what a bummer. Because I, the one model didn't work, and and then I was like, you know what? This porn star will work. She's kill, she's kicking ass or whatever. And, uh, nope. So then I had to go to Pornhub and look her up on Pornhub to see actual shit. You know, I don't know. You know, unbelievable. I'm pissed off. Uh, got any other things happening? I don't know. How much time we got? We got like eight minutes. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, I, can tell the, uh, I guess I can run through my flat tire bit. Okay. Well, that's the deal. Well, flat tires. Deal. Yeah. You get them, and then you can't drive. <laughs> uh, no, we were leaving, so... That sounds like a bowling ball. One of our places we stayed was like this, where all these cabins were. It was actually pretty sweet. But, uh... We get in the car, and we had to throw the trash away in these trash cans that are, like, all lined up by one of the cabins. Yeah. So I was in my head, I go, should I walk it over there, or should I just throw it in the car, and then we could drive around, and then, you know what, I'm fucking lazy, I'm going to drive around. So we drive around, put it away. And then as we're leaving, oh, so you drove <coughs> by a garbage can, maybe there's some glass See, I don't, over there. Well, because it was, like, it was like a nail, because yeah. I saw it. But I don't know when I got. I didn't know if I could have gotten so it. It was a nail right in the tread, right? Yeah. Okay. But uh. So that happened. So it was sticking out of the tread. Yeah. So I don't know if I got it the night before. Like I don't know when I got it because when I we were driving, we were, le- we were leaving in the mo- it was either the night before or that morning because I don't I don't know how fast if it was like a slow leak or whatever. But we were leave we were but we were like literally driving out of the down like the driveway to leave and all of a sudden low tire pressure like ding and I go oh fuck because I just knew I was like I, I doubt it's like you know how like when you have a car for a while low tire pressure like comes down but like it's just because your tires the, air, the pressure yeah. fluctuate because it's like winter time now yeah this dropped quick it's yeah, this, going eight well, this, I mean it didn't, PSI, it didn't say it because like with this car this car was crazy because it had like all this computerized shit. So it had like sensors for everything. Yeah. So it said low tire pressure light, and then it went, it like a little diagram of the car popped up with the tire with all four yeah. tires, and then it like that's how mine the is. the back the back left tire went ding ding ding. It started blinking, and I was like fuck. So I get out, and it's flat, flat, flat. like yeah, completely flat. Stop. So I was like fuck. I go well hold on, and I backed up just to get it off like the driveway. Yeah. And I'm like well I got to change this tire now. So change the tire. I'm changing the tire, which I did pretty quick actually. I was yeah. like. Man, that's pretty fat. Damn, dude. Because it was like... I'm a man. I thought... Because, you know, like, when you change the tire with the shit they give you in the car, you don't get, like, this nice big four-way. You get yes. a little tire iron that's, like, I this know. big. And I'm like, it's fuck, I'm not going to be able to break the fucking... Like, but, like, I just... I got them all with my know. hands, so I was like, oh, I didn't have to step on it or kick it or anything. And I was like, cool. And then, when you lift the tire... Like, after you loosen the lugs and you get the, t- the car oh, off the ground, the tire never just pulls off. You have to, like, kick it off or whatever to break. Yeah, yeah. But, like, I just... So the car was like brand. It was a 2021 yeah. Hyundai Sonata. It yeah, only right, had like 4,500 miles on it. So the car was new as fuck. Yeah, dude. So I think that, that's that's why. I mean, it was a newer car, so whatever. Yeah, so I pull nice. off, put the new tire on, boom. But the whole time, Jen's calling like the rental car place. Yeah. And she called the number for. Do you have to pay anything? Well, let's okay. get to that. Yeah, yeah. So she's calling like some other number now because she called the number for the actual office we got the car from but no it just rang forever so while she's calling I'm like let me try calling again so i call 
and someone picks up immediately. And I go, hey, uh, we have a flat tire. I just put the donut on. But, like, I don't know what you want me to do. Like, I don't know. They're yeah. like, um, well, go see if you can get the tire patched. And if you can get it patched, then we'll reimburse you whatever it costs. Uh, I like, okay. I go, what if it can't be patched? And I say, okay, well, you just got to get a new tire, but you have to get the same brand that's on the car. And I was yeah. like, okay. And the brand's weird. Yeah. And Shizaki. so we go to a discount tire. Yazaki. Because I was like, well, I know discount. I like discount. I've always been like, every time I've yeah. gone to a discount, it's always been cool. And they, they fix, they patch for free. Discount will patch so for free. So does Bell Tire. Yeah. So I go there, and the guy looks, because I have the tire in the trunk, and the guy looks and he goes, oh, okay, that looks that looks like it's going to be uh, be able to patch, no problem. I'm yeah. like, cool. So he's like, uh, we're, pr- we're pretty much caught up right now. It's about 45 minutes. And I was like, oh, my God, no, this is amazing. That's like dreams in it. Yeah, I was like, this is great. It took two and a half uh, well, hours like, for me. We're yeah, dry. Time. It's funny how, like, your your expectations change because before the flat tire, gonna suck. if someone told me, hey, what if you had to go wait at a, a – what if you had to go get this tire patch right now? I would go, that'd be so annoying. But once it's flat and I have the donut on and we're already driving, now my expectations are – Man, if we're in and out, I'll be so fucking happy. Because I said to Jen, I go, if it'll take like an hour, hour and a half, two hours, I'll be happy. So we get there, and he was like, 45 minutes. And I went, oh, my God, that is amazing. So yes. he, we were like, we like, because it's in this like uh, like a whole like area where there's like a sports store. And like, like, like it's like a, uh, you know, like when you go up to the hill, it's like stores everywhere. It's like well, a center. Well, yeah, a strip so, yeah, like a strip, but it's like all like parking lots. It's yeah. like all circled so around. Like, uh, so like there's, an outlet mall. There's, yeah, uh, yeah, pretty much. Yeah. You know, there's food places, Verizon store, whatever. So there's a Starbucks right there. And we go into the sports let's store. Let's go walk through all the stores. Yeah, it's a <laughs> store. Then we're like, let's go get Starbucks. So we go to Starbucks, we get coffees, yeah. and then we walk back to discount. It's going to pick me up. And then while we're sitting in discount, the guy comes up. He goes, so the nail went really far in and hit the sidewalls and fucked it up. So we can't patch yeah. it. And I was like, fuck. And then the guy could tell that I'm so. I was like, you can tell I was like, this yeah. is so annoying. Cause you can tell like, you're really hard. You know, it's from like, oh, yeah, fuck. he's like, oh man, oh, shit. That, guy, that guy's getting turned on. This guy's getting this. hard. Um, yeah. because right, I told him that we were on vacation and that we're from Michigan. Yeah. And like that we were about to drive out to the coast. And Michigan people don't give a yeah, fuck about fuck. patches. Dude. It was funny when he drove in. He's like, "What's your name?" So I gave him my name and everything, or my name, and my phone number, and he goes, "Corey," and I was like, "Yep." Give him my Twitter. <coughs> and he goes, oh, you still got the Ford Focus? And I was like. Oh, yeah. I was like, looks like the last car I took to a discount. I was like, that's no. funny. And I was like, well, we got a rental. I've upgraded. I'm so when 31. he said it had to be fixed, and they don't have the tire, the brand of tire, and of then course. he's like looking it up, and like the other discount tire that's in Portland, which is three hours away, or like four whatever Jeez. hours away, Jeez. they have like they have like three of the tires. So he was like, oh, we can have them ordered, but it won't be here till Friday. And it was like, ugh, Wednesday? Ugh. And I'm like, in my head, I'm like, well, we're on vacation. Hey, we're uh-huh. not gonna be here till Wednesday, till vacation. Friday. So I go, hold on. I call the I call the uh, the rental car place back. And I'm talking to a different guy this time, and I was like, yeah, this lady told me I had to get the same brand of tire, but they don't have the same brand of tire, and like, I don't know anywhere around here that does. Because in my head, I'm like, why should I have to fucking find the same brand? No. So then the guy goes, ah, uh, no, and he's like, hold on, what's your name? Blah, 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 blah. Pulls up the we'll, rental we'll car, and I can hear him like in. talking to somebody else, and then he goes, yeah, it can just be any, just throw. Just get a new tire. Doesn't matter. I was like, cool. And yeah. come to think, because the guy was, because then I was like, okay, fine. Hung up, and I talked to the guy at the discount, and he was like, oh, right, what tire you want to put on? And I was like, it doesn't matter. He's like, you want to just get like the cheapest one or whatever? And I was like, sure. So in my head, I go, because I was looking at when he was looking up the tire that was that weird brand on the car. I could see the prices on the side because they have like what they're doing on the computer. They have it on another screen that you can see, so you can see him clicking and typing and everything. And like the prices of those were like three hundred dollars. And the one I got was like a hundred and eleven. Yeah. And I was like, I'm pretty sure I just saved this rental car company two hundred dollars yeah. by getting whatever tire. Yeah. Why? And also, why the fuck do they care what tires on the car? No. They're running the car out to people. Fuck. So I'm like, whatever. So it all worked out. I didn't think end. people had tire problems outside of me. I thought it was a big Michigan thing. Our roads are terrible, dude. Thought it was only us. Roads out there are immaculate. Yeah. That's and nice. it's so funny. They have a sign for a bump, and it's just this. You're like. Gook. Oh my god! People, and then people, I, like barely anything. I go. I drive on worse than this, and there's no warning. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Every road, every single road in Michigan. Yeah, me and I Jen, get mad. Me and I Jen go, kept like making jokes. Yeah. At some, every time we go, uh oh, here comes a bump. Oh no! And, and it's just, just like you're literally like, and we're like, oh my god, dude, you're fucking like, and just like smack into a pothole. Yeah, I'm I like, would, oh cool, my tire just came off. Yeah, I would. uh 
actually buy vehicles and have a motorcycle and a bunch of cool shit if I lived in a place like that. But yeah, dude. we're here, and I'm like, I'm just going to lease because everything's going to get ruined. Yeah, everything's going to get wrecked, bro. This fucking road. You should get a motorcycle, and then we can... <laughs> we can uh get dirt bikes. Dude, I do want to do that. Just get like a... I'm ready. All right, I'll pull the trig. Yeah, I'm buying everything, dude. About an AC unit, the house is feeling dude, good. Dude, I would pull the trigger on a dirt bike. If I um, found like one that was good enough. My price. only thing is just because my uncle Paul in Ohio, he knows all that shit. Yeah. So I'd be and like, I'm pretty what sure do I need like to do? Easy to work in. Yeah. They're not super complicated. He showed my brother Alex. My brother Alex is fucking stupid. Yeah. And he can do it. He's a fucking idiot. Hey. Hey, Alex. Hey, are you watching this right now? Idiot. Hey, Alex, dude, guard me. <laughs> hey, guard him, you old fuck. Hey, let's play basketball and and see if you could guard me. Oh, do you technically need to be in a midget league? <laughs> oh, is my knee brace your problem? <laughs> just, bump, you bump into he's me? Just screaming oh, at, I got he's a scratch. Just, he's just listening, oh. screaming at us right now. I wish I was there so I could rebuttal. Well, that's not the pod. Yeah. The pod yeah. is we say whatever we want without anybody saying anything back to us. And then the all best. of our viewers know our brother's a little bitch. Yeah, and that, they don't get your opinion. We don't let them hear they your side know, of the story. They just know my brother's a little leprechaun that can't guard me. A little leprechaun that doesn't even have a pot of gold. A little leprechaun. He ain't got no gold. You don't even have lucky charms. Dude, you stopped eating cereal long ago, a little fucking leprechaun. No lucky charms. And you're old. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Guard me. <laughs> Play in a fucking 50-year-old league, dude. What do you mean? Your knee's 50-year-old. 50-year-old. Hey, oh. vote Republican because you think it matters. Hey, yeah. Yeah. Think microchips are in me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to microchip me even though my phone does it all. Hey, dude. Yeah. There's chips everywhere. Yeah. They got you. They already got us. They got your phone, dude. They already got you. They already got us. Dude, dude I'm I, probably being filmed by the camera right now. They're like, we got everything he's doing. You better delete that TikTok app. Yeah, like every other app. They all got me. I love how like, it was like a big thing. Like, oh no, it's by a Chinese company. And it's like, and the Chinese are going to do what with the information that the United States isn't already dealing with the information? You fucking idiot. Yeah. You have Facebook. You have an Instagram. Even if you don't have those... You have an iPhone. No, I have Samsung. Oh, okay, Samsung is better. You're, you're all idiots. Just accept we're being ruled by our overlords. Yeah, dude, just go fishing, play basketball, take a shit, check off, get AC, get a patio. Live life, dude. Stop worrying about microchips. Yeah, the only thing you should be worrying about that's micro is your penis. Yeah, it's your micro dick. Wait, are we still talking about Alex or just general people? <laughs> I don't know. I thought, we, I thought we moved on to general Here. people. 